In the 1990s, more specifically in the early years of that decade, one of the most iconic and influential models in the fashion industry emerged, Claudia Schiffer. With her unique beauty and unmistakable style, she captivated the attention of the fashion world and rose to the status of one of the most recognized supermodels on a global scale. In the 1990s, Catherine Zeta-Jones began to attract attention in the entertainment industry. Born on September 25, 1969 in Swansea, Wales, she started her career as an actress and singer from a very young age, but it was in the 1990s that her artistic journey began to stand out. In the bustling New York City of 1973, Motorola engineer John Mitchell was spotted with his latest revolutionary project, the first mobile phone. The device he carried with him marked a crucial moment in the history of communications. In the image, it is possible to see Margaret Ann Neve at the age of 110, photographed in 1902. Her remarkable life journey began in 1792, when she was born and extended until 1903, the year of her passing. What makes her case truly extraordinary is the fact that she lived across three different centuries, making her the first person to be verified and recorded in history to reach this impressive milestone. Natalie Wood was an iconic actress who reached the peak of her career in the 1960s. She was born on July 20, 1938, in San Francisco, California, and took her first steps in the entertainment industry during her childhood, acting in films from the age of four. In addition to her achievements in the cinema, Natalie Wood also found success in television, starring in acclaimed productions. In the illustration, it is possible to see a postal worker delivering a letter in the year 1910. The mailman is portrayed in a typical setting of that time, wearing clothing and accessories characteristic of that historical period. At the turn of the 20th century, the Postal Service played a vital role in communication, with mail carriers being instrumental in ensuring the dissemination of correspondence and information among people. In this depiction, you can see a group of individuals gathered on a street in Brooklyn in 1946, eagerly tuning into a baseball game between the Dodgers and the Giants on the radio. The radio broadcast of games was a highly popular and thrilling way to follow baseball matches during that era. In the year 1914, Wing embarked on a daring journey by driving his Mets Model 22, becoming the pioneer to take an automobile to the rim of the Grand Canyon. This remarkable achievement was recorded as the Mets Car Adventure, marking a historic moment. The Mets Model 22 was an exceptional vehicle for its time, known for its endurance and reliability. The photograph taken by Ruth Orkin in 1951 depicts a young American woman walking through the streets of Italy, where she catches the attention of men who watch her as she passes by. The scene portrays how she receives numerous whistles, which at that time were seen as a form of compliment. The American girl is the center of attention, and her presence seems to fascinate the men around her. In the year 1965, the renowned French actress Claudine Auger achieved fame by portraying the role of Domino Derval in the film titled Thunderball. Her performance as Domino Derval marked a high point in her career, earning her international recognition. In the film, she played the lover of a villain, which made her one of the most memorable Bond girls in the iconic James Bond franchise. In 1953, a historic image captured the thrilling competition between Wilhelm Noll and Fritz Krohn in a BMW sidecar racing. This form of motorcycle competition was filled with excitement, featuring a specially designed vehicle that included a side compartment to accommodate a passenger or co-pilot. In a scene captured in 1939, we can observe an intriguing invention, a four-person bicycle positioned at the end of a street. This peculiar bicycle was designed with a unique approach, featuring two levels that allow four people to pedal simultaneously. Its unusual design incorporates a sewing machine station, adding an interesting additional functionality. In the year 1966, a parking enforcement officer was captured in a scene in the city of Chicago. Wearing her distinctive uniform, she was dedicated to her daily activities of parking enforcement in the urban area. The photo, though seemingly simple at first glance, can be appreciated as a historical record of the society and the profession of that time. The image portrays the same woman on the same motorcycle, in front of the same house, with an astonishing 71 years difference between the two photographs. This comparison is truly captivating and emotional as it allows us to witness the passage of time and the continuity of a person's life over such an extensive period. In 1979, Candy Loving gained notoriety when she was named the Playmate of the Month for January in the renowned Playboy magazine. Born on September 4, 1956 in Oswego, Kansas, 
Candy Loving started her career as a model and quickly captured the entertainment industry's attention with her beauty and charisma. In the year 1973, during the oil crisis, a notable event took place in Amsterdam known as Car Free Sunday. On this particular day, the city's streets were closed to motor vehicle traffic, including cars, as a measure to conserve fuel. Taking advantage of the absence of automobiles, four horseback riders rode through the streets of Amsterdam, enjoying the rare opportunity to explore the city in an unusual and eco-friendly way. In 1956, IBM introduced an innovative device called the Hard Disk Drive, with a revolutionary storage capacity of 5 megabytes. This historic milestone in information technology represented a significant advancement compared to existing storage media at the time, such as magnetic tapes and punched cards. This hard disk drive paved the way for the evolution and improvement of data storage systems that we use today. The final known photograph of Charlie Chaplin was taken before his passing on December 25, 1977. In this image, we are presented with an intimate moment of Chaplin, capturing the figure of one of the most prominent icons in the history of cinema. In the 1890s, a photograph portrays a Victorian couple amidst their travels. Dressed in the characteristic attire of the time, they are captured in a moment of adventure and exploration during their journeys. The image gives us a glimpse of the fashion and customs of the Victorian era. Catherine Zeta-Jones is a remarkable example of dedication and perseverance, carving her place in the entertainment industry and emerging as one of the most beloved and respected actresses globally. Her journey over the years continues to inspire aspiring artists as she continues to captivate the audience with her remarkable talent and charisma. In the 1920s, a photograph captured the cinema actress Easter Walters standing riding her motorcycle. While perhaps not as famous as some movie stars of that era, Easter Walters was a part of the film industry and contributed to the world of entertainment in the 1920s. In 1962, photographer Takeyoshi Tanama captured an intriguing photo of a mini car on the streets of Tokyo, Japan. This peculiar compact vehicle is an example of a K car, as they are known in Japan. These compact cars were designed as a response to the need for mobility in the bustling city streets. In 1959, photographer Keyes Scherer captured an iconic image titled Office Girls on Wall Street, New York. The photo portrays a group of women working in offices in the renowned financial district of Wall Street in New York City. These office girls are symbolic of a period when women began to gain more space in the workforce, contributing to the changing dynamics of the job market. In 1931, a charming scene was captured in Lustgarten in Berlin, Germany. In this image, we can see young pilots participating in an exciting children's sidecar race. Lustgarten is a famous public park located in the heart of Berlin, which served as a very popular space for recreational activities and sports events during that time. In 1994, Nadia Auermann, a talented German model, was at the peak of her career, becoming a prominent name in the fashion industry. Born on March 19, 1971, in Berlin, Germany, Nadia Auermann captivated the world of fashion with her unique beauty and impressive height of 1.80 meters, 5 feet 11 inches. Her elegant appearance and distinct proportions made her stand out on runways and in advertising campaigns for prestigious fashion brands. Throughout her career, she made a significant mark in the fashion world and continues to be an inspiration for many aspiring models.